She was investigating a commotion in the neighbouring room. That's when Grace found herself at the wrong end of a 45. Two shots were fired. She was dead after the first. And the husband? Not a scratch on him. He woke up after we had the shots. Then we found this. Give me everything we have in the lag down murders. This is gone long enough. State your name for the record. Travis Hardman, is this really necessary? It's just standard procedure. It's absurd. You know, it's strange. You seem to be coping remarkably and don't know how you do it. What can I say? When you're moments away from meeting your maker, you tend to put things into perspective. I wouldn't expect you to understand. Are you having problems? Nothing to write home about. So just usual fallings out. I'm sure you have some war stories of your own, Detective. Guilt follows us like a shadow. Does this symbol mean anything to you, Travis? If you have come to me, Looking for another head to mount on your wall, I'm afraid you are mistaken, detective. I am not the Langdale killer. Let's hope you catch him while you still have something left to lose. You're doing that face again. What's wrong? I got an offer. How long? In months. I want you to come with me. We have had our feet on the ground for all of five seconds. Do you really think now is the time for something like that? We can't just uproot. Well, if we want to see each other, I'm not sure what other options we're going to have. Do you even like the job? What do you want me to say? Job's a job. It serves a purpose. It's a good jumping off point for us. And what good is all of that if you're miserable? I think the real issue here is you don't want to see me leave. You say that like it's a bad thing. Well, maybe it is. What's wrong, William? I'm fine. It's just, uh... <laughs> hey, when people call me William. Let me fix you a drink. I came as soon as I heard. What drives a man to tear a family apart like that? It's, it's just inhuman. Who said anything about man? I just mean... Aren't you worried? What good has worry never done anyone? It could save your life. Yeah, well, so could sobriety, yet here we are. William. Sooner or later, something dreadful is going to happen. And I, for one, don't want to be around when it does. So the way I see it, you can either wait around here for Langdale to find you, which he will, or we can leave tonight. Together. Mary. You know I can't do that. Tell me again where this perfect little family is that you care so much about, because I only count two people in this room. She never cared about you, or your goals, or what you wanted, and you obviously never cared about her, otherwise you wouldn't be sat here with me right now. So why the hell not? I think it's time you left. So you're telling me no? I'm saying enough, leave. If only it were that simple. I've still got a job to do. I'm taking you to Langdale.
So you are him. The Langdale killer. I mean, I'm flattered, but... Uh, I think a simple phone call would have yielded similar results, wouldn't you say? Still stop this, there's still time, okay? You don't <laughs> just drop the gun. Just drop the gun. We can figure out what you need, okay? What do you <laughs> Shots left. Is this really worth dying over? You're doing that face again. What's wrong? Everything's perfect. William, this is Mary calling on behalf of Travis and Hardman. You may recall we spoke on the phone in the week. I'll be supervising your 10 months here at our Langdale branch, so be sure to get back to me when you've received this, and we can begin your induction process. We look forward to working with you. I know that look. You're her. It's in this her that a man needs his home. Now, a home is worth more than its foundations. Home is family. Sure, family may stumble along the way. We'll argue, we'll scrap, squabble and fight. These things are inevitable. As long as we remember the good times, which there are in abundance, we'll always have a home to come back to.